YouTube, it's Zoe or Red by Zoe, and today I'm going to do the B Room Cliff Tag. I did the Merry Kiss Cliff Tag a couple of months ago, and this is the female character version. You have a bunch of different female fictional characters in here. You pick three out at a time and you decide whether you want to be them, be their roommate slash best friend, or you want to shove them off a cliff. Let's get started! <laughs> Round one! We have... Ginny Weasley from Harry Potter, Tessa Gray from The Infernal Devices, and we have Katniss Everdeen from The Hunger Games. Wow! That is a lot of important female characters in this first round. I'm going to have to throw Katniss off a cliff just because I'm too afraid to be her best friend and I really don't want her life but also I'm afraid to push her off a cliff because I'm pretty sure she'll survive and then she'll come for me and kill me. And I will obviously have to be Tessa Gray because one, I love her as a character and also she has two wonderful men, including Will Herondale, fighting for her. I will have to have Ginny Weasley be my best friend. She's a pretty cool person, especially in the books. She's a little lame in the movies, but I love Ginny in the books. So I would want book Ginny to be my best friend that would be so cool. Tessa and Ginny, that's a great duo. Round two. We have Georgia Nicholson from Confessions of Georgia Nicholson, Rose Hathaway from Vampire Academy, Becky Bloomwood from Confessions of a Shopaholic. This is really hard because I love all three of these characters and I wouldn't mind having any of their lives. I want Rose to be my best friend because I really could not handle her life. She's an awesome person and she would make a great friend. She's such a great friend to Lissa, but her life is way too stressful for me. I do not know how to fight at all. I would be worthless against the Strigoi and all of the Maroi would die because of me. So she will definitely make an amazing best friend. Becky and Georgia are really similar characters except Becky is in her late 20s and Georgia is a teenager. They're even both English and they love to shop and they are witty B Georgia just because she's younger and Becky during the series she becomes a mom and she gets married and I'm just not ready for that right now but I definitely don't want to cliff her because she has a child and she has people to look out for so I would definitely destroy this family doing that. That was really hard. Round three. Alice Cullen from Twilight, Elizabeth Bennett from Pride and Prejudice, Bella Swan from Twilight. Weird that they both got in this one round. I want Alice to be my best friend because she's such a great friend and she's so funny. I want to be Elizabeth Bennett because of Mr. Darcy and also I love the time period that she lives in and I'm going to have to cliff Bella but she won't die. There's no way she could die because she's almost died a billion times in that series and also in the last book things happen she just won't die but you know I'm best friends with Alice so I think that I would also become friends with Bella. Maybe she'll forgive me for pushing her off a cliff. She probably won't come and kill me like Katniss would, but she definitely would be a little bitter. Round four, Scarlet from the Lunar Chronicles, Professor McGonagall from Harry Potter, Kath from Fangirl. Okay, I'm definitely going to have to be Kath because we're already pretty similar people except She's with her fan fiction, how I am with my YouTube videos. So, duh, I want to be Kath. Cliff Scarlet, just because she's my least favorite of all of the different Lunar Chronicles main characters. I'm going to be best friends slash roommates with Professor McGonagall. Zoe and McGonagall just hitting it up, hitting up the clubs on a Friday night. But she could teach me magic? Round five. Isabel Lightwood from the Mortal Instruments, Selena Sardothian from Throne of Glass, Annabeth Chase from Percy Jackson. Oh my gosh, this is actually a terrible round because these are all such great people. Oh my gosh, I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. I think I'm going to have to throw Selena off a cliff. Selena would not make a good friend. She was a good friend to a lot of people though. Like to Nehemia, they were great friends, but... I wouldn't want her life and she's not as great as a friend as these two ladies. I would obviously want to be Isabel. 
Like, obviously, who wouldn't want to be Isabel? She's just such a great person. And I would be best friends with Annabeth. Selena and Bella and Katniss, if you are watching this, please don't come for me and hunt me down. I'm just playing a little game here. Please don't kill me. <laughs> I have so much to live for. And the final round. Who do we have in here? Tris Pryor from Divergent. Queen Lavana from the Lunar Chronicles. Juliet from the Shadow Me Trilogy. All of these people's lives are terrible. I guess if I have to choose one, I would want to be Juliet just because she has a pretty cool superpower. Also Warner. I also admire her personality. She's really fierce and she gets down to business. I would want to be Triss's roommate, but like Triss in the first book because she gets kind of weird in the later books. And in the first book, she still like kind of has it all together. I could be living in Dauntless with Triss, but hopefully I don't have to go through any of that training because that would stink. But also I'm Juliet and Juliet could go through all the Dauntless stuff. And obviously I would want to cliff Queen Levana because she's the villain. If I would want to be her, I think we would need to give myself a talking to. So that is the B Room Cliff Tag. I hope you all enjoyed. Leave down below who you would not want to kill you if you were to throw them off a cliff because I feel like all the people who I threw off cliffs, bad idea! And thank you for watching. I will talk to you later. Bye!